This is Sugar Free Reviews. I'm back with another video. Today, I just did a pickup order from the Columbia Tavern in Lemonster, Massachusetts. I went with a variety of different things. Let me tell you, these bags weigh a lot. So, let's see what I have going on in here. Ooh, these are hot. These are two bags of French fries. Bucky's already picking out what he wants to have. We got a cup of chili right here. They hooked it up with utensils too. We got a steak and cheese. Yes. Mayonnaise on the side, awesome. They also remembered, I asked if there was a way, get down Bucky. I asked if there was a way they could sell me a side of their three cheese house-made sauce. It's right there. They did hook me up. I appreciate that. What else do we have going on? Ooh, wow, this is huge. Fettuccine Alfredo with chicken and broccoli. This thing's massive. It is burning hot, weighs a ton. And last but not least, Hickory Burger. I had to change the table, as you can see, to make sure I had enough room for all this food. I'm excited to dive in. So I had put a post on one of the Facebook groups to ask people what they like from this place. I've never had any food from here before. So I'm gonna start off with the chili. Yeah. Smells really good. It's got all this melted cheese on top. Look how big this cup is too. This was only five bucks. That's a steal. Nice chunks of meat, some kidney beans. I did ask for them not to put uh, raw onions on top. They got my order right, 100%. Staff very friendly. cat wants to try some too but you're gonna have to wait a little bit that's really good the flavors in this chili really good and I'm picky when it comes to chili mm. very meaty a little bit of spice there's a little bit of sweetness they're not lacking at all with meat. That's one thing I find sometimes when you get chili, they put very small amounts of meat and just load it up with beans. And this has beans in it, but I'm getting mouthfuls of meat. This is really good. Really good. All right, one more bite and we'll move along. Mmm. <laughs> I would definitely go back just for the chili. That's super good. All right. I wanted their cheese sauce on the side. Sorry, the cat, again. He uh, is trying to become famous. I wanted their cheese sauce on the side because they make it in-house and I wanted something to dip my fries in. Oh yeah. Mmm. Their three cheese homemade sauce. Really good. My fries still have a nice crisp to them. Bucky, get down. Get down. That cheese sauce is fantastic. Wow. Throwing that on the chili too. Alright, I gotta, I gotta keep moving on here. I haven't had this place. I'm getting more excited after the things I keep trying. Um, let's try this steak and cheese. They said it's shaved ribeye, and then you can get whatever else you want on it. I got onions and mushrooms. Wow. 
Look at that. The cheese is literally oozing on the side of it. I don't even know if I'll need the mayonnaise. Mmm. Mmm. Look, I'm dropping. Look at how big these mushrooms are, too. Look at that. I love mushrooms. I don't even need the mayonnaise either. And I love mayonnaise on a steak and cheese, but they have enough cheese on here. Everything's creamy. The onions and the mushrooms are cooked perfectly. That's really good. Really good. I'm so happy right now. Mmm. I'm just making, making my way around. I'm not trying to rush this video, but I know that um, my cap on YouTube is only 15 minutes. So I want to make sure that I squeeze them in without having anything cut off because this food is exceptional. Actually, I want to jump into this fettuccine alfredo with the chicken and broccoli. This thing is massive. And it is scorching hot. I live two minutes down the road. Look at the chicken that they give. This is incredible. I'm going to pick up this chicken right here. Here's one big piece. Look at that. That's just one piece of chicken right here. Here's the other piece. It's massive. Look at that. That's insane. And this is only 15 bucks. Then you have the pasta and the broccoli as well. I'm feeling spoiled. All right. I'm gonna try the pasta separately with, from the chicken. It smells really good. I smell garlic. Mmm. I can taste the garlic too. That's real good. I gotta cut some of this chicken now. It's pan seared chicken. Mm. Sorry, I just gotta mm. cut this up for me. So now we're gonna grab a piece of the chicken with broccoli and a piece of pasta. That's really good. I love all that garlic flavor you get from the sauce. If you're a garlic fan, you're going to like this dish a lot. It pops out right in your mouth. Mm. The only thing I would put on it, because I like to put black pepper on my pasta dishes, is I'm going to add a little black pepper after. But this is awesome. And look at all, I can't even believe how much food in this plate. Mmm. Mm -mm. All right, we're going to head over to the next item here, which is the hickory burger. Oh, look at that. Toasted bun. It's not soggy or anything either. I can still feel the crispiness right on that. Look at that. That's nice and grilled. That's how I like a roll. And then you got the bacon, the caramelized onions, the cheese, and the sauce, and even the bottom bun. You think from sitting in here for a little bit would get soft. No, there's still a crisp. Can you hear that crunch? There's still a crisp on there. Mmm. I'm excited. Look at that bacon, too. Bacon is overloads on the corners. Just want to give you a glimpse. I don't know if I gave you a good view of the top. You're going to probably hear the crunch when I take a bite out of this toasted bread. Mm. 
That's good. So, on that first bite, I taste the smokiness from the barbecue sauce. I taste the bacon. I taste the delicious char on the burger itself. I taste the caramelized onion, the bread, oh, everything. The patty, the patty I can tell is decently um, seasoned. Mm. That is so good. I love having a grilled flavor on a burger. That's an awesome burger. Wow. Something else right here too. I don't know what this is. I don't want to forget about it. Oh, look at this. It looks like some garlic bread. Mmm. Smells good. You can smell all the seasonings on this. Look at that. Not skimpy at all. Look at that. It tastes like it's an oil that's infused with spices. Like, you go to certain restaurants and you get the samples of bread and they have a homemade oil that you can dip them in that's flavored. That's what this bread tastes like. That's really good. Still has a crunch on it too. So I must say, my first trip for takeout at Columbia Tavern, I am so impressed. Everything hot, fresh, delicious. When I called, they told me 15 minutes. I showed up, my food was ready. I'm impressed. The staff, everybody awesome. The proportions alone on the food. I can't say enough about this place. The chili is amazing and their homemade three cheese sauce. Awesome. So if you're in the area, you want some pub food, have a couple beers, looking for a burger, they got flatbreads, they got other meals too that I've seen on there. They got buffalo wings, stop in there. You won't be disappointed and that's the Columbia Tavern in Lemonster, Massachusetts, and I'll see you guys soon with another video.